Yo, what's good everybody? This is Chris here from Series Designs and today I'm going to make you another tutorial dealing with Cinema 4D and Photoshop. So, yesterday I made a tutorial on how to export an image from Photoshop into Cinema 4D in order for you to make it 3D. Okay, now, after that process is done and you already made your text or logo or whatever you want from Cinema 4D 3D, you would want to put it back into Photoshop in order to design it. Am I right? Yes, I am. So, <laughs> anyways, after you have it already 3D, um, what you want to do, your render settings should be, uh, go to save, <clears throat> name it, I already named the series, now what you want to do, you want to go to format, it's the most important part by the way, well one of them, uh, you go to QuickTime PNG, and then you click this alpha channel, if you don't click the alpha channel, then your image, when you render it, it will come out as the whole entire picture, it will have the background with it and everything. So, if you click Alpha Channel, <clears throat> it'll only give you the text, so you can edit the background and do whatever. So, that's about it. Make sure you go to Anti-Alias, make it as best, and then render it. Here you go. Alright. You want to go to Photoshop, open it looking for it I saved it on my desktop <clears throat> and there you have it now you can do anything with it you just put a background right quick ah, there you go so like I said you can edit the background and everything you know this is just a basic tutorial so um <clears throat> thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe peace